Hey guys, this is Ken from Mahalo.com. Don't skim through this video or else you'll miss out on learning about the skim feature in iMovie 11. iMovie is an amazing place to store all your video because it gives you instant access to all your videos. And with the skim feature, you can instantly jump to your favorite moments. To skim through your videos, just move your mouse pointer over the film strip. You can customize how quickly you skim through your videos by dragging the frames by thumbnail slider. So if you move it to the right, the skimming speed will greatly increase. Dragging it to your left will slow down the skimming speed. This comes in handy for editing. If you want to change the size of your thumbnails, we just use this slider up here and it will scale your thumbnails. If you want to see the date and information while you skim your videos, just choose View, then Playhead Info, or you can use the shortcut Command Y. While skimming through your video and you see an event you would like to play, just hit the space bar and it will play in the same position as your mouse pointer. If you want to play your video full screen, just hit the full screen button. You can do this both in your project library or your event browser. Or you can just hit Command G. When you use Command G, the full screen mode starts off where the mouse pointer is on the timeline. When you move the mouse pointer in full screen mode, it opens up CoverFlow browser. From there, I can easily scroll through other events or skim through the video. Then just hit the space bar to view. To make the CoverFlow browser disappear, just move your mouse over the video for a moment and you go back to full screen mode. To get out of full screen mode, just hit escape. One last tip. If you don't want to hear the audio while skimming through your video, you can hit the skimming audio button. And that has been our tutorial for the skim feature in iMovie. This has been Ken from Mahalo.com and I'd like to thank you for watching. And if you guys want to take a quiz to see how much you remembered, just click here for the command shortcut quiz.